Prince Harry, 37, fell off his horse at a polo match on Friday, June 10. The Duke of Sussex was photographed at the Santa Barbara Polo and Racquet Club in California, where he took a tumble off his horse and fell to the ground. Other polo players rushed over to help Harry, who was unhurt in the incident and quickly got on another horse to continue in the game, according to Metro. Harry's Los Padres team lost the polo match 12-11. Afterwards he was seen hanging out on the sidelines with his celebrity pals David Foster and Catherine McPhee, as well as his teammate Nacho Figueras and Nacho's wife Delfina. Harry was dressed in a green t-shirt, white pants and black riding boots and knee pads for the game. He reportedly went through three horses throughout the duration of the June 10th polo match. Harry and his wife Meghan Markle have been back home in California for a week now after they traveled to the UK for Queen Elizabeth II's Platinum Jubilee. The couple weren't on the balcony with other members of the royal family at the Trooping of the Color, but they did attend a special event and were spotted taking part in many festivities over the weekend. They made their first public appearance at the Platinum Jubilee for the Thanksgiving service. Queen Elizabeth, 96, finally got to meet her great-granddaughter, one-year-old daughter Lilibet Diana Mountbatten-Windsor, during the Platinum Jubilee celebrations. After Meghan and Harry returned to the U.S. with Lilibet and their three-year-old son Archie, Hollywood Life learned exclusively that the couple was thrilled about how their visit to England went. Their trip was a whirlwind and jam-packed from the moment they landed but it all went beautifully, a source close to Harry and Meghan shared. Their whole aim was to show the Queen their love and respect, and of course introducing her to Lily for the first time was a big highlight. Archie and Lily totally charmed her, getting to see her with them made the whole trip worth it.